Yeah, my name is Matthias Luther. I'm working for the Friedrich Alexander University in Germany. I'm the chair of the Institute of Electrical Energy Systems. And uh, we were working with a powerful simulator since 2018. Yeah, indeed, the power uh, system has changed uh, in the last decades very much. So we are converting the system from conventional generation to renewable generation. And uh, uh, this uh, raises a lot of challenges and uh, uh, new uh, system interactions and uh, new system interactions mean also new tools we have to use and one of these uh, yeah, important tools here uh, in future uh, which we by the way are using also for education uh, is real-time simulation. Yeah, in, in general we are uh, dealing with a grid and if you deal with a grid you have also to deal with all uh, devices which are interconnected to this grid. We are dealing especially in the field of real-time analysis, we are uh, dealing with hardware in loop and power in loop. We are uh, doing research also on protection systems and uh, in this respect also HVDC. Uh, analysis, so hybrid grids, and uh, in this respect we are using the simulator. Our simulator uh, in uh, Nuremberg is one of the most powerful uh, at uh, European university level. We are uh, quite happy about this, we are step by step extending this and uh, it is also um, very nice in this respect to work together uh, with the support of uh, TDS technologies. Uh, uh, we uh, are very often consulting uh, with them and uh, uh, we get uh, very uh, important hints in order to extend our system. As I was a student, I, I had a, a, a digital calculator and uh, our students today using offline tools like MATLAB Simulink and uh, the future generation uh, of our young professionals will use real-time analysis. I'm, I'm quite convinced that this is a, a, yeah, a, a necessary and very powerful tool uh, for future education and research.